Hi guys, so this video has been highly requested. I'm gonna show you how to make my favorite dessert ever. I probably make it, I don't know, three to four times a week. Um, I always crave it. It's my frappuccino ice cream made from almond milk. Now, before you guys are like, oh my gosh, almond milk, it is absolutely delicious. I stopped drinking milk two years ago and I don't even miss it. I think almond milk is great. Um, I think I would actually drink almond milk over milk anyway. Um, but let's just get started and we're gonna go into my kitchen. You're gonna need some unsweetened almond milk, pasteurized egg whites, stevia, preferably in the raw, and a thickening agent called gargum. You can also use vanilla, maple extract, or stevia to sweeten it. I'm going to be using Sweet Drops toffee flavored. I froze a cup of coffee in these cute little heart-shaped ice cube trays. You can freeze these overnight or for as long as you need and use them whenever. I also froze about three-fourths of a cup of almond milk in ice cube trays as well. First, what we're going to do is put the ice cubes into our Ninja. If you don't have a Ninja, you can just use a blender or a food processor, whatever you have available. I'm just going to blend this a little bit to get it kind of broken up. Then we've got our other mix-ins here. So I'm going to add a splash of vanilla. A splash of maple extract. Gives it a nice buttery flavor. And a little bit of toffee stevia. It's a little running though. Then I'm also going to use one decaf Folgers um, instant coffee packets packet of instant coffee and then you can kind of give it a little stir to see and then because it is really icy right now I'm going to add just a splash of almond milk and then you can go ahead and blend again for my blender at least I uh, have to keep taking the cap off and kind of stirring it around. So it's really just going to be all on your blender. And you can keep adding in almond milk if you think it needs to be creamier. And then once you're all finished, this is pretty much what it looks like. As you can see, it's super creamy, just like normal ice cream would be.